Welcome to Style Guide, where we discuss the latest in beauty, fashion, business, must-have items, the trendiest trends, red carpet looks, and so much more. I'm your host, Brittany, and this is Style Guide. Today, our top stories are Normani is the first brand ambassador for Savage Fenty, James Charles gets his own reality beauty competition show, and Black Friday deals. Let's talk about it. And let's not forget money talk. Hmm. We're going to find out why Kylie Jenner is $6 million richer. Listen, we cannot keep up with these Kardashian Jenner girls, and I am here for every bit of their hustle. So let's go ahead and get started. Normani is Savage Fenty first ever brand ambassador. The 23-year-old was handpicked by none other than Riri herself. How amazing is that? OMG. Well, anyway, this holiday campaign, which is out right now. You can also see Normani perform during the Savage Fenty show in September, available right now on Amazon Prime. Next story. Friday, now is the perfect time to get all those items that you have been eyeing all year round. There are so many great deals going on today and you have until midnight to get it done. Don't forget to check out Juvia's Place, which is giving out 65%. And they have a bundle, a huge bundle, which involves four palettes, two highlighters, a blush, and some brushes, and so much more for $90. Go ahead and check out Juvia's Place um, on the actual website, and Ulta as well, for they are giving away so many things. And speaking of Fenty Savage, Savage Fenty, they are giving away 65% today. So Black Friday deals, yes, today is the day that you want to shop until you drop. Let's move on to James Charles now. Media maven James Charles is now partnering with YouTube for his own beauty reality competition show. The winner will receive $50,000. I do know that the auditions have now ended. It ended on November the 21st for you to send in your uh, video for to audition for the show. I absolutely think that this is a wonderful idea. And coming from a reality beauty competition show myself, I absolutely love that James is now hosting, executive producing, and judging his own show. And the fact that YouTube is now giving their creators a platform to create other avenues. Like, that's amazing. Zalga are totally for this. We have now came to a segment in our show where we like to discuss beauty and business. And we call this money talk. Why? Because this is a multi-billion dollar industry where all of us can get a little piece of the pie. So unless you have been living under a rock, I'm sure by now you have heard that Cody bought Kylie Cosmetics for $600 million. Million dollars. $600 million. <laughs> Kylie girl, can I borrow a dollar? I'm just saying. Well, Cody Cosmetics has now owned Kylie Cosmetics by 51%, which means that Kylie owns Kylie Cosmetics for 49%. And in layman terms, what that means is that she still has creative control over her, um, her cosmetic line. It's just that when it comes to the final big decisions, she doesn't really have a say-so because it will now be um, on Cody. Cody makes the final say-so on big major ideals. But yes, she is still involved in her company because she owns 49% now. That's all we have for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Style Guide. Don't forget that we will be back not this Friday coming up, but the following Friday for episode three of Style Guide. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And remember, use the hashtag Style Guide. I want to hear what you guys have to say. Anyway, later lovers.